The APCU Solidarity Network has described as senseless and shadow chasing the Tuesday's call by the Senate for the resignation of the current service chiefs. The youth group said the resolution made by the Senate following the motion moved by Senator Ali Indume is a clear indication that the lawmaker and other stakeholders in the northeast, northwest have declined the necessary support to the president and service chiefs in a fight against Boko Haram, Ishwap, and banditry, kidnapping, and other crime be the villains of parts of the country. Addressing the newsman on Wednesday, Comrade Danesi Mormon, on behalf of the youth group, advised the National Assembly to concentrate on its constitutional duties and desist from the excitement of interfering with the lawful divine responsibility of the executive arm of government. GCFR is evident in the previous and vexation resolution calling for the resignation of the current service chiefs. The Senate is obvious majority are from our dear party APC. We vote them, we elect them, and we are cautioning them that they should face their duty. The Constitution is clear what the Constitution saddled the, the Senate. For them going otherwise is not of the interest of our dear nation. The service chiefs deserve commendation, not unnecessary attack. And we, the APC family, we will not welcome that, and we are cautioning them that they should take to their heels and do what is necessary and what is needful. We record that during the Senate preliminary of July 21st, 2020, and based on the motion raised by Senator Ali Idume, with additional prayers by Senator Francis Fadawusi and contributions of other lawmakers in the Red Chamber again or cautionably pass a resolution asking the service chiefs to resign over alleged abuse of soldiers in Katsina and the voluntary resign resignation of soldiers of the Nigeria Army. We find the resolution of the Senate ludicrous, senseless, shadow chasing a barazi and an incongruent with the reality of the issues of the service chiefs who are doing their best to curb the insurgent spirit of insecurity in some parts of the country. There is every reason to frown at this baseless acclamation of the Senate. And it is painful to realize that the same Senate, which vehemently refused to respond to pleas by leadership of Nigeria Army for improved and adequate budgetary votes in the 2020 Appropriation Act for the Army, which is involved in multiple internal securities operation, should, should delight in passing a resolution for the resignation of the service chief, or even contemplate to raise a voice calling for the attack. This is the irritably barefaced by hypocrisy and exhibited by some of our leaders. It is condemnable in every, in every facet. The Senate is, the Senate is, is people with respected leaders from both the north, the northeast and northwest. But shockingly, none of them has done anything or even willing to support President Muhammad Buhari, his government or the military in any way to win the war against insurgency. Therefore, we cannot descend the obsession of same leaders with call for resignation or sack of service chiefs. Instead, of recognizing and appreciating the much, the much they are doing over the insecurity situation in our dear country, Nigeria. The group therefore commend the service chiefs and Nigeria troops for the wonderful job in containing insecurity threats to Nigeria from armed bandits and terrorists. Okay.